with our ATL lecture. So in the last video we have just started, I know the ATL period is a very interesting period for you, am I right? Yes. So in the last video we have just gone through the what is mean by the coding, am I right? So what is actually the robotics? Robotic is nothing but it consists of some mechanical part that I have shown you in the first video. Am I right? We have discussed about the mechanical part. Then there are some electronic parts. There, there are some mechanical part, electronic parts. Now which are the electronic parts? There are some sensors, LED, then uh, Arduino. These are the different types of electronic parts which I have not still introduced to you. But we have just studied for the mechanical parts. So what are the actually the mechanical parts? Which, which parts we have learned? Mechanical part, do you remember? We have discussed about a rectangular plate, a marine L angle. These are the different mechanical part which we have discussed in the last video. Am I right? So in the today's and in the before that video we have discussed about the coding. We have discussed about the coding. Now coding is what what is actually the coding? Do you remember what is the actually the coding? Coding is nothing but a language, the communicating language with a computer. Communicating language with a computer. Now there are the different types of the language. You might have heard C, C plus, Java. Am I right? Yes or no? No. For the now, for the autonomous robot, the robots which are autonomous, for example, which move by themselves, means they have some sensors. Am I right? How do they work? They need some coding. They need some coding and they work work on it. Am I right? They work through it. Am I right? For example, you might have seen the different types of the autonomous robot which works by themselves. Whether they have some uh, jadu or something, no, we are feeding some code. Then what is actually the coding? How the coding is prepared? Do you know now this whole world, this whole world is going to be all the world, whole the world is working through the machines. Am I right? Yes or no? This whole world is working through machines. Now machine is very important. Now am I right? Now you are having a, a one kind of machine in your hand so that you are, you are able to hear my voice. The distance between you and me is very vast but still I am with you. We, our whole school is with you. Why? Because of the machine am I right because of some electronics equipment in this mobile or in any kind of the equipments electronic equipments there are some small instruments which work through it are you getting so today in the last video I have discussed about what is the I have just introduced about the coding what is actually the coding am I right it is nothing but a communicating language with a computer now see if I will speak computer now uh, the robot which I have prepared I want to move that now see now you know I have taught you to prepare the four wheeler am I right so if I will tell the four wheeler uh, huh, just move a four wheeler whether it will move no I have to set some program no see, see for whenever now your daily routine is there am I right you have some daily routine with you wake up in then you your daily course you are doing and then uh, and then you are preparing for your school am I right yes or no so like that for the coding there is a systematic way the instructions should be given in a systematic way to the computer and so that it can follow the particular path. It can follow the particular path. 
are you getting that systematic way is called as an algorithm is called as an algorithm what is the actually the algorithm algorithm is a set of instruction now see when you are going out or so for a picnic whenever you want to go for the picnic your mother is giving some kind of instruction to you don't do too much masti don't do this don't do that am i right do behave like a good child yes or no even your teachers are giving your instruction for every more in every point of you am i right we give the different types of instruction to you see now your exams are near you have to study like this you have to be prepared for like so the instructions are given to you and so you follow the instruction properly and you work on it and the result is positive am i right yes or no so like that the instruction should be given to the computer for the to uh, to help the program am i right to get our work done we have to give some instruction am i right now there are the different types of recipes am i right the, the recipes your mother might be watching during the lockdown yes or no then there are the different types of recipes are been um, are been uh, are been done by your mother at that time the mother is mother is giving that this type of instruction you have to do you have to prepare like this you have to take this first you have to take that first then you have to prepare it properly am i right these instructions are given so like that in the same manner we have to give the instruction to the computer and the set of instruction given to the computer is called as an algorithm is called as an algorithm are you getting and and the algorithm and the instructions which are given by the computer the instructions which are given in by the computer and that instructions if we are preparing in the form of the diagram if we are preparing the instructions which are given and if we are preparing a diagram that is called as a flow chart that is called as a flow chart are you getting now see our students uh, i want to one thing let's see our students are uh, you know the due to the robotics due to the robotics the students have won the international level number our one team was selected for the international level and it was sponsored to the london am i right so when we were in the delhi for the second state le state level we have won it was held in kolhapur and in the second uh, second the national level was held in the delhi am i right so in the delhi we have to face first viva that is oral means they were they used to ask them how you have prepared the robot is there any logic behind this where what is the application of the robot now see the success of the medals which the students have won is not only because of okay simply joining and simply they have joined and uh, they have got the achievement it was not like that the success was their hard work day and night the students have worked uh, very hard and they have achieved and the determination which was given so they have got this medal am i right so be before that they have also achieved they have Uh, for that they have done a viva am i right what is a viva viva is nothing but oral whether where, where they have asked for the algorithm and a flow chart so you should know how the particular robot or particular uh, partic particular set of the robot works are you getting this so in today's video we are going to discuss about algorithm and flow chart you might have understood what is the actually the algorithm algorithm is something but a set of instruction given to the computer and flow chart means what the instructions which are given when when it is converted into the diagrammatic form that is called as a flow chart that is called as the flow chart are you getting i hope you have understood this two point in the next video i will teach you how to give the instruction to the computer by the algorithm and that how we are going to convert into the flow chart are you getting
so i hope you have understood in the last lecture i have told you to prepare the scratch means if i want to heat any particular object then how i can prepare the robot not a single child has given me how they can prepare the robot so i have given see i have given i have written some uh, how we can prepare the uh, uh, the robot to heat the particular object okay so go through it once again and try to prepare the robot how you can lift the object today's task is you have to uh, make a robot uh, you have to uh, write the how you can prepare the robot to lift the object are you getting thank you